Hey Metro North family, welcome back to the channel. I hope you're all having an amazing day. Today I'm going to show you how to attach a OneDrive file copy to your Office 365 Outlook email. Now this is going to be sent as a copy, not as a link. So without further ado, let's jump into it. Okay, we're here at our Office 365 Outlook and we're going to go ahead and we're going to open up a new message and then we're going to go ahead into our OneDrive and we're going to get a file copy to send as a copy. Now, we're going to come over here. You can see new message. All right. And as you can see here, we have the field and we'll just say we're going to send it to myself. All right. We'll just say OneDrive copy. Okay. Under subject. And we're going to come over here to attach. Now, now you're going to be given some options when you click attach. Now watch what happens. Now you can browse this computer. That option means that if, say, you know, you're going to attach something from your local computer that you have on your documents folder, on your laptop or your PC, that's fine. You also have the option to browse cloud locations. And the cloud location is going to be your OneDrive. So let's come over here to the browse cloud location. All right. And as you can see, we have, uh, this is my OneDrive and I have a bunch of few things in here. Um, and let's just say I choose Wilburn Temporary Closure Greeting. All right. And I'm gonna choose Next. Now, look what happens. I get this option pops up. How do you wanna share this file? You can share it as a OneDrive link, which is what you don't wanna do. Or you can uh, attach as a copy. That's actually what we wanna do moving forward. The reason for this is that there's a new restriction on the Metro North OneDrives that we can't share links from our OneDrives with external contacts for security reasons. So we wanna make sure that you're attaching it as a copy. Now, if you don't see this option, okay, let's say you hit next and it immediately just, you know, uh, attaches it as a OneDrive link, you know, to the file. So what you would do here, we'll just close that for just a second, and we'll come over to this cog right here, settings. Now if you click that, you're gonna see uh, it comes up with attachments and sharing preferences. And look at the first one. For files I choose from the OneDrive, ask me how I want to share them every time. That's what you wanna have marked. It's if you didn't see the message before where it was giving me that option to send as a link or as a copy, it's very possible that it has defaulted to, you know, maybe always sending it as a, one, uh, a OneDrive link. This is here and clicking that cog and that settings cog will allow you to go ahead and change that and give you the choice. So where it says here, ask me how I want to share every time, we click make sure that's on. And then down here for, uh, for files I choose from group files and we can make ask me how I want to share them every time, just so you have that option and you're able to do that. And we're going to go ahead and we're going to hit save. Okay, and we'll go like that. And then again, Wilbur Temporary Closure Greeting, we're going to hit next. And then if you weren't getting this option, you should now if you've corrected the preferences and saved the preference uh, to always be asked how you want to send it. So I'm going to choose, we're going to as a copy, because again, we can't share OneDrive links anymore with external contacts because that actually allows external uh, contacts outside the safety of our, our, our cloud infrastructure to go into um, your, your OneDrive. Okay. And there we go. So as you can see here, this is attached as a file, a real file, and it's not just a link to the file to your OneDrive. So this is actually what you want to do moving forward um, as a security best practice. All right. So that's about it. If you have any questions, please feel free to give us a uh, contact us, you know, um, and we'll be willing to help you out with anything you might need. So thank you for watching.